Mark Harmon hints at his upcoming book and could return to a memorable role. During his recent appearance on The View, Mark Harmon talked with the ladies about his new book and some of his most famous roles. Harmon denied a possible comeback to NCIS as Detective Larry Gibbs, but he did hint that he might be playing a cherished part again in a follow-up, as well as giving his NCIS character a fresh spin. Sarah Hain suggested a possible follow-up to the 2003 movie Freaky Friday. Well, we have the ideal segue to having you here at our table, she remarked. Ed Helms was just here discussing Family Switch, his new body-swapping Christmas film. Jamie Lee Curtis has informed us that a sequel to her 2003 smash song, Freaky Friday, will be released. You are in the original, she continued. Are you gonna be in the next one? I think talking to Jamie is where you got to be on this, and if she wants it to get done, it'll get done. Harmon said, failing to provide a clear response. He went on to say that she is quite persistent and that he has known her for a long time. It could be time to start pestering Jamie Lee Curtis on social media for a sequel, if that's what fans are looking for. In addition, Harbin will make a comeback to the NCIS universe as executive producer and narrator of the upcoming CBS series NCIS Origins, which is centered on a younger version of his NCIS character. The concept for the new show originated with his son, Sean Harmon. The character of Gibbs has been an important part of my life for 20 years, he stated. I had the honor of playing young Gibbs in the past, and I watched my father craft the role as well. I'd have always thought there was a narrative about his early years that was worth telling, so I'm excited to be joining Gina, David, and my dad in producing this story and showing off a different aspect of this well-liked figure. In addition, Harbin discussed his most recent work, Ghosts of Honolulu. A Japanese spy, a Japanese-American spy hunter, and the untold story of Pearl Harbor, a historical nonfiction book. With more time on his hands after leaving NCIS, Harmon pursued his other loves, writing and history. After Harmon conducted extensive research on Douglas Wada and discovered some incredible tales, the book tells his genuine story. This is the first story, leading to the birth of what became the real NCIS, Harmon revealed. In actuality, these agents are a distinct breed. I hope a tale that you are unaware of is disclosed here. They were performing significant work, but no one was aware of it. Leon Carroll Jr., who served as a genuine NCIS agent for 20 years before joining the program as a technical advisor, co-wrote the book. I was always asking him about the right way to do something or the way he would do something. Harmon said, speaking of Carroll Jr., I never participated in an interrogation on this show that I didn't discuss with him. I wanted this notion to come true when it first occurred to me. Without him, I wouldn't touch this, I said.